sorry about the glare, but I um, just want to tell you, I came in to look at this painting. I painted this two nights ago, and I think it's finally dry. I can touch some of it. Um, I'll have to do a true dry result outside in the sun whenever it stops raining and I have a better day so that there's not a glare. And I have a couple other paintings that I want it to see if it goes with in a set. Um, but I was just overwhelmed by joy and excitement when I looked at this. To look at it as it's dried and to see what kind of people and beings and spirits that I can find or sense in this painting and see if I can learn the story of it or what it reminds me of or anything like that. Um, I was overwhelmed with joy that um, something happened to me in the past year. I used to always come in and look at it and think, oh, well, this happened. This went wrong. This didn't turn out the way I wanted. Oh, it's textured. Oh, it might crack a little bit. But now I don't care. That's just none of that stuff. I used to come and look to see what was wrong with it, to see what I could do better next time. And I still do that. Like, I still take note of things that I can change. Like, I changed the ratio of pouring medium for one of the paints on this one. Um, and it came out a lot better than before. But I just came, instead of coming to look at this piece to see what was wrong with it, I came to look at it to see what I loved about it or to see what stories I could find in it or what beings or creatures or spirits or just worlds that I could find in it. And I just came to look at it with excitement and energy. And I'm just, I wanted to make a video to say how happy I am that I've made that change. That now I just appreciate it for what it is instead of looking at what's wrong with it. I love that. Let me know what you think. What does it remind you of? Did you see any spirits or beings or energies or stories in this? Let me know. That's, um, sorry. That's how I've been developing my psychic abilities. Also, um, art gazing and looking at the images hidden in the abstract art, excuse me. Looking at the images hidden in the abstract art and letting the spirits or energies tell me the story and tell me about this world that I've put on the paper. I didn't create this world, it already existed. I just channeled it onto canvas. Um, and that's what's helped me grow my psychic abilities too. And I think that's what has changed and why I like it. And I come to my art with excitement and joy and like a little kid opening a new book to see um, what story is inside. That's how I come to look at my paintings after they dry. I love it. Bye.